The combined pledge comprises financial support and assistance with the rollout of the country's vaccination campaign. NAMDEB's financial chief, Willie Mertens, noted that the group has previously contributed to the efforts against the pandemic and will continue to assist the government in bringing it to a stop. The group, our contribution is largely to assist the government to acquire more doses to contribute to our country's target of in calculating 80% of our, of our population to reach COVID-19 herd community, immunity. We believe that this can only be successful, success, successfully achieved if the, if the private sector and the public sector works together to achieve this target. To put this 26 million donation into perspective, 13 million will come from the DBS group and the other 13 million will come collectively from Deb Marie Namibia, NAMDEP and the NDTC. The aid is hoped to assist in securing adequate vaccines, medical facilities, personnel and equipment, among others. Prime Minister Sarak Wongira Amadira commended the entities for coming on board, saying government on its own cannot bear the strain of the coronavirus pandemic. We all can see that the situation uh, is escalating, the COVID situation is escalating. We are much grateful for, for the support that you are uh, providing through this donation and uh, we would like to encourage other corporates to, to follow suit. Um, yes indeed, uh, we, we need to ensure that our people are healthy so that our workforce would be healthy. We need to ensure that the economy is prospering uh, here in Namibia and uh, abroad and uh, given the infectious nature of this disease it is important <clears throat> that the support in all corners of the world, uh, or rather the efforts in all corners of the world to fight COVID receive support, because it is only when we are able to defeat COVID everywhere that we would be able to defeat it anywhere. Um, so we very much appreciate this. Luciani Findaka, NBC News, Venduk.